have two ideas to send to corporate and a list of snacks that the black people in this room don't like. Every room, Garrett. Okay, does anybody have anything actually useful? Uh, I, I uh, think it might be helpful. It, it, oh, sorry, Nia, did you, did you want to say something? No. Are you sure? Because I, I don't want to make this about me if, if, you've, if you've got something. I don't want to make it about you either, but I don't have anything. Okay. Uh, well, okay, so, look, I, I think it's great that we're, we're trying to fight these racist policies, but I also think that we should be pitching actively anti-racist policies as well. Yeah, like asking corporate to sell more products from black-owned businesses. I was just going to say that. Cool, let's all give credit to Jonah for Janet's idea. No, no, that's, no. That's, that's... going on the list. Janet? I think a lot of us want to help, but we just have blind spots when it comes to this stuff. I mean, when I was growing up, we were told the goal was to not see race. Okay, see, I don't know who started telling white people that. I'm assuming it was other white people, but you shouldn't ignore race. You should be aware of how being black affects our daily lives. Wait, you're black? I thought you were Dominican. What? No. You're not even a little Dominican, like Puerto Rican? That's not how it works. But Garrett's right. We're dealing with microaggressions all the time. Yeah, like certain employees always asking to touch my hair. I'm not naming names, but if I were, they'd be Isaac. <sighs> I'm sorry. Your hair looks fun. Oh, Dude. Really? OK, fine. Janet, your hair doesn't look fun. Is that better? It looks like a bad time. No. Oh, wow. How about Justine trying to sound blacker when she talks to black people? Oh, that's how you going to do me? Uh, I've experienced a ton of anti-Asian racism since Corona started. Yeah, customers have said some really terrible stuff to us. I've been getting that, too, and I'm Hawaiian. Well, you look Asian to white people, so don't go thinking you're cleaner than us. Yeah, we're the cleanest people here. I'm sick of everybody acting like all black people have it worse than white people. Like, look at Will Smith. His life is way better than mine, and our debut albums came out the same year. Isaac, I guarantee, all things being equal, racism is harder for black people than it is for you. Go on, tell them about how your life is harder because you're black. Wait till you hear this. I think it's going to be pretty bad. Oh, really? Um... Uh, okay, so a couple weeks ago, I bought a Nintendo Switch. A white dude follows me through the parking lot and goes, you got a receipt for that? Ugh, white dudes. So this is the kind of stuff we're working to address with this list. Uh-uh, forget the list. We can get back to the list. The personal stories are breaking through. Give us another one. So you just want me to tell more stories about messed up stuff that happened because I'm black? Exactly. Hit us with a big one. <sighs> Fine, okay. Racist story time. Gather around, everybody. Oh, whoa, no, no, no. Don't actually scoot in.